Goblet is what they in Australia or in the New World they call bush vines um, or goblet pruning in other places. It's basically the idea. The reason we put put this arborella in was to to well, my workers call it Sean's vineyard because the problem with it we can't get any tractors in it. So anywhere they're going through it, they're, they're, everything has to be done by hand. So they're basically swearing at me, going, Sean, Sean, you know, why did you do this? So it's called Sean's vineyard. The idea behind it is to get high density. We're up to eight thousand, nearly nine thousand plants per hectare in that bit. And the idea behind it is to get something else. It's just a small plot. We've got half, 0.7 of a hectare of, of Alberta. I'm going to put a little bit more down in, in the new bit. But the idea is each plant gets stressed. It's got it's basically pruned so you have a spur on, on each of these and those each one of those will produce uh, two, uh, two stalks um, and so you, you've got eight berries, eight, eight to six bunches on each one. Um, the wonderful thing about Alberella is when it's at the state it's in now is it's, there's no wires. You can just, it's, it, I don't know, something about it which has just got more freedom and, and more natural because you're walking through it at all angles. You tie it up. It's a bit of a pain because you have to tie it up. You have to get in there early enough to tie it up and keep it keep it high. Um, but it's it's always the first one to bud. It's always the first one to pick. Um, and so it's it's an interesting interesting. And the great the, the it's because it's so dense, the roots are going down really deep. It's taken much longer for that vineyard to get going because of the competition between the, all the plants. So, but now it's there. For, it's been there for over ten years. So it's starting to produce some really good stuff.